At the end of yesterday's video, you may recall that I said something to the effect of I better do something about these sharp screws sticking out here. <laughs> because you know Murphy's Law, and especially with me lately, if I can scratch myself on something, I will. And I better get that sharp drill bit out of the drill press as well. Okay, that's going to be a lot safer. Anyway, getting a bit of a late start here today. So if I'm going to have this thing up and running by uh, upload time tonight, I better move. Okay, what I've done is I've cut little spacers that'll hold this out just about the right distance. And this one piece here, I've, I've cut it about half an inch too short. But I think if I go in at an angle, I can get the screw to catch. Anyway. You get the idea. Okay, just the same on the other side now. Okay, we should be able to take this bar out of here now. Then remove this piece. Now before I get these pillow blocks too permanently fastened into place here, I want to do a bit of a dry run. And uh, better back this one off just a little bit here. I want you to be forewarned. The next few minutes while I'm trying to get this thing mounted on here are going to be rather boring and I'm going to be saying a lot of stuff that doesn't make a whole lot of sense. I'm just sort of talking to myself there. I know what I'm talking about. But like I say, I'm not making a whole lot of sense. Now I guess I'm going to have to back it off more. Okay, now we'll see where is this going to come.
Now for sure, at this stage, I do not want to be dropping anything. Maybe I better fasten this down just a little bit better first. Okay, right now I just got a loose fit going on here. And, uh, you know, I cannot tell you the amount of fooling around and adjusting and readjusting and taking screws out and moving them over and retightening. It's just unbelievable. Um, a lot more than what I had anticipated half a year ago when I started this. I will be so happy when I can say, I'm done. Anyway, let's see what's going to happen now. I've noticed in this series that I'm doing a lot of, uh, you might say, complaining in sort of an apologetic way. I'm always apologizing for something. You know, like, sorry it's taking so long, and I thought we were going to be done today, but sorry we're not. Yeah, well, sorry about that. Looks like I have to do more adjusting. Okay, right now, everything is fastened on. And uh, I've got a lot of adjusting to do right here. Down here, there's a, I don't know if you can see it, this sort of looks like a wooden box, octagon box. It's actually full of lead. I can't remember how much it weighed. I made it about 25, 30 years ago for another clock. And it was the weight that drove the other one. Anyway, now it's driving this one. I might have to add more to it. But uh, let's just try our, our winding mechanism here and see if it'll wind it up a little bit. I don't want to wind it up too much. I do have, a, like I say, I've got a lot of adjusting to do right here uh, in the escapement. Uh, we may not have this running today. Okay, now you will remember the key. Okay, that's all I'm going to do. Just put a little tension on it. I don't know how I did that. You know what? We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.